And this is one of the biggest stories on WDTN.com right now. After first reporting it on Living Dayton, Pam Elliott drove to Columbus to get you answers from state leaders about this much welcome deal. She continues our team coverage with what she's learned. We came here to the state house seeking answers. Why is the governor not traveling to Montgomery County to make the announcement? Why was it going to be here tomorrow in Columbus? We only found one person from the governor's office and he said he could not comment. We also went across the street to Jobs, Ohio. No one was available there either except someone from Human Resources who stepped out of her office to give us this release which we had already received from the governor's office. 800 jobs, that's what it says. We'll be here for you tomorrow in Columbus. Reporting from Columbus, Pam Elliott, 2 News, working for you.